Yo, what is up guys? Joker bringing you another video for Once Human. So it's been brought to my attention that people are still continuing to freeze to death in the way of winter. And I figured I'd go ahead and make a short video going over how you can stop freezing to death. Because the last time that I've had to worry about the cold was like... I don't know, 20, 30 hours of playtime uh, ago. So let's go ahead and go over a couple ways that you can not freeze to death. So starting us off, first and foremost, the easiest way is going to be carrying around a torch everywhere when you're not directly in a combat. This is definitely a way, but it only changes your temperature by about 5 degrees Celsius, and it does not work if it's on your back, so it is not that effective, but it is still an mm. option. The first real thing that I would recommend is Hedium. You're able to get it as essentially your first memetic unlock. And what it is, is it's a stone that gives you 10 cold and frost resistance. It's super easy to make. All you need is to have a crafting bench and you're going to make a couple of thermium first. You're going to just need gravel. So once again, super easy to get. And once you have the gravel, you just need to use it with charcoal. Don't make a bunch of these at once. You really only want to make one at a time because they last for an hour, but it is consecutive. It isn't. Yeah, it is consecutive. So like if I make four of these, then I'm still only going to have a hour of the plus 10 cold res as opposed to four hours. You do have to essentially reignite the helium every hour by coming back to your crafting bench. The next thing is going to be making sure that you're using the right hide in your equipment. In the way of winter, they added a, a function for every hide, right? You get additional stats for every piece of hide, making it worth it for you to go ahead and kill a whole bunch of different animals. I've seen a lot of people using cowhide because you think logically you get it from a buffalo. It should keep you warmer. But as you can see here, cowhide increases your maximum carry capacity. It does not increase your temperature gauge at all. You can use deer hide, but from my testing, deer hide only increases your temperature by about 5 degrees Celsius. You want to go ahead and be using, where is it? It is bear hide, right? Bear hide is what I am currently using in my gear. And as you can see, let me show you my heat meter real quick. It's massive, right? I have not, I can be swimming in water at night and not even worry about getting hypothermia. But let's go ahead and show you the effect. So it's on my jacket here real quick. Cold resistance and frost resistance plus 10. Recover 3% HP upon defeating an enemy at 10 degrees Celsius or below, which is going to be everywhere right so it well at least everywhere besides an ember strand i'm assuming but we can't even go there yet so it doesn't even matter so this is plus 10 and then i have the same thing in my pants <laughs> oh my uh <laughs> I have bare skin for the material my pants are made out of as well, giving me an additional plus 10. So not only do I get a free plus 22 cold and frost resist, when I kill an enemy, I recover 6% of my HP. Uh, in case you're unaware of where <laughs> unaware of where you get bear fur, let me go ahead and show you. You're going to want to make your way over to Wishland East and come to the Wishland Zoo. There's going to be a whole ton of animals here, including bears. Oh, he literally just killed it. Whatever. Uh, there's going to be a whole ton of animals here, including bears and corrupted bears. Both of them will give you the hide that you... Well, both of them will give you bear hide, right? They don't take that long to respond. So if someone recently cleared it out, you just have to wait a minute or two and then you'll be all good. You can also farm wolves here. You can farm a 
crocodiles around here. You can farm capybara for normal hide. Just an overall good place to farm, right? And once again, we'll zoom in a little. You can either accept the Mr. Mr. Wish quest, or it's right about here, uh, 2,565 and 5,664. And that's where you're going to be getting your bear hide. I haven't found any other bears, so... Um, this might be the only place, but there may also be other places where you can. I just personally haven't found them. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Just wanted to make a relatively short video showing you how to deal with cold, give you a couple of solutions, stuff like that. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to stay up to date with this and future content. And until next time, take care.